Let us discuss the difference between Hadoop 2.x and 3.x. So 3.x is obviously is having some more features, more attractive features and compared to the 2.x. So let us have one comparison table to discuss about them. So here we are having this Hadoop 2.x and Hadoop 3.x. So the here the fault tolerance is done by replication only. As same data will be replicated onto multiple nodes. So whenever we are having some failure in one of the nodes, we can retrieve data from other nodes. So that is the replication method is our failure recovery method here. So now in this case, we are having the fault tolerance is done by eraser coding. So eraser coding means actually the huge volume of data will be divided into multiple small parts. They will get encoded, they will get expanded with some additional codes and then they will be distributed onto the different storage systems and that is known as eraser coding. So that is the Hadoop 3.x new feature. 200% of HDFS is consumed by the architecture storage. So 200% will be consumed by the architecture storage but here in this case only 50% so we are having more space to work with. So it has the limited scalability and the scalability is improved here. That means here for the load sharing we can go for horizontal scaling here. So the scalability in this case can be done obviously but it is limited but here it has been improved. So it uses DFS that is the distributed file system Amazon S3 and FTP storages here. But here it has all storage systems and additionally we are having the new feature that is a Microsoft Azure data lake can be used in case of storage systems. Next one is the manual invention is needed for name node recovery. We know that in case of name node recovery in case of Hadoop 2.x we can have the pig, hbase, hive to do the name node recovery but that is manual but here to recover the name node manual intervention is not needed. So manual intervention is not needed in case of Hadoop 3.x for the name node recovery. It can handle up to 10,000 nodes in one cluster but here it can handle more than 10,000 nodes per cluster. Minimum supported Java version is Java 7. Here it can deal with minimum supported Java version is Java 8. So it uses HDFS balancer to balance the data. So for the balancing of the data, this we are using here HDFS, but intra data node balancer is a new one will be used for this node data balancing and it comes from HDFS disk balancer. Next one is that it can be deployed on Windows environment and it also supports for Microsoft Windows. So these are the main features that is the differences between Hadoop 2.x and Hadoop 3.x. Thanks for watching this video.